Whizbang's Workshop comes out March 19th, and we're going to talk about all the Druid cards that were revealed for the set. And there's some broken stuff coming for Druid. Let's get right into it. Uh, seven mana Aulonius, and it's a 6-6 six, six legendary. Um, it's huge. Spell damage plus one. Your spells get double bonus from spell damage. So, um... It says it, he, they think that it does doubling effect stacks. Um, and I, I think they're probably going to be right. Um, Druid is known to be having broken stuff across the board. So this should be huge. Um, and then, of course, there's some other pieces. Here's some spell damage cards that you could be playing for this. And we're going to talk about the newer ones or what have you. Um, but yeah this could be pretty busted broken and oh my god um double bonus from spell damage so expect some nutty stuff from druid yet again next up and this one's just you know i mentioned it multiple times now what in the flying fig newton is this six mana five five sky mother aviana or aviana depending on where you're from battle cry shuffin 10 random legendary minions into your deck and they cost one uh, okay you know shuffle 10 random legendary minions into your deck legendary minions are normally pretty good so this one is going to probably be also broken um, we'll see what happens I don't know if I want to make any oh this one's absolutely going to be nerfed um, this one might not be nerfed but you know, giving Druid um, more legendary cards is sometimes a bad thing. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm still excited to see how this one plays out. Next up, three mana nature spell and Smallin. So if you liked in Biggin, you'll love in Smallin. I don't know. Um, I think I see some synergy here with the next card that's coming up, but reduce the cost and attack of minions in your deck by one. Um, could be interesting if your main focus is spell damage and getting that double spell damage and you don't care what your minions are, um, but it could have other potential somewhere here. Um, I'm interested to see how this works because I was a huge fan of Inbigger and Druid. Um, it was one of the, the cards that got me into playing Druid a lot more when I had never played it before. So excited for this one. Uh, one mana Jade Display. And this is what I was talking about. I think that has some synergy here. It's a 1-1 one, one Jade with the Death Rattle is your Jade Displays have plus one, plus one this game. Shuffle two of them into your deck. So maybe there's some sort of uh, synergy within small and to where you can make a bunch of these with a, you know, with, with, with no mana cost and then just flood your, uh, your board state with a lot of these heavy hitters. We'll see what happens. Um, you know, I haven't looked through all the uh, neutrals as well, but I'm sure there's some broken stuff coming from Druid. Um, next one up is the four mana, two, four dragon, Chia Drake. Miniaturize. Choose one, gain spell damage plus one, or draw a spell. So here's the mini version. You know, uh, you're also going to gain spell damage here. And th this should be interesting. Um, draw a spell, cultivate, and then seedling growth. Gain spell damage plus one. This one should be quite interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm going to reserve judgment on it. But it's a good dragon, and look, Dragon Druid is very powerful right now, so maybe throwing this in has some options. Hopefully we'll see something new on the Dragon Druid. Um, it wasn't as popular as Treant Druid recently, but it's still a fun deck to play. Next up, two mana wind up sapling. It's a two one and it's got tradable. Uh, one of my favorite keywords. Battle cry, refresh one mana crystal. Ta uh, trade to upgrade. Okay, um, trade to upgrade. So maybe this is looks like it's going to be tradable every single time. So if you just sat there and just trade it, trade it, trade it, trade it, you'll be able to refresh all 10 if you're trading it 10 times. Um, that's what it looks like. Um, I don't see any indication that would be different, um, but we'll see what happens. Next up, three mana sparkling file. Uh, deal two damage and your next card this turn costs that much less. And it's an arcane spell and... It's a spell, so the spell damage plus one. Um, will there be something with this? 
maybe i don't i don't know um it what freaks me out is i see these three stars here and i'm thinking that's part of the mana for some reason i don't know why um but i'm just looking at that but the art is wicked and i'm going to reserve judgment on this one you know the, the druid cards are going to be interesting to see what happens with some of these new um you know these these new setups and these new combos if you will uh, next up, five mana Woodland Wonders. Summon two, one, five beetles with Taunt. And then it's Caustic. Three less if you have spell damage. And my understanding is, from what we've seen, it's easy to get spell damage. So these are going to be three less. And they're one fives. Taunt, not crazy difficult to get through um, right now, this day and age when we're playing. But it's still pretty big, especially with there being two of them on board. But it's 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 cool and the art is wicked um this looks like a quill bore so anything we can do with quill bores because quill bores are awesome i'm down for it uh next up two mana bottomless toy chest arcane spell discover a card from your deck if you have spell damage copy it who doesn't love copying spells who doesn't love i mean excuse me cards who doesn't love copying druid cards there's Druids going to have no problems getting extra stuff in their hands or their decks or the battlefields right now based on what I've seen. So this is pretty cool having two of them. Uh, next up, it's a location. It's a one mana location, Magical Dollhouse. Uh, gain spell damage plus one this turn only. So put this in there. There's three charges of it. And you don't see a lot of, uh, you know, of the, the cards that destroy locations. So this one is going to be interesting. Yeah, I like this. I like the ability to just call it as you need it. Just put it on the board. Um, and yeah, you lose one board space, but you have the ability to just call up that spell damage plus one whenever you need it. Excited to see how the Druid cards are going to go this expansion. Don't forget, giveaway. I've said that five times tonight, but I've done five videos tonight. So yeah, um, I'm going to give the winner a shot uh, March 11th. I'm going to announce it, and it's for a WizBangs Workshop um, expansion bundle. And for every 500 subs to my channel, I'm going to throw a mega bundle into it. It's from my wallet. And let's go ahead and make me spend gobs of money. Um, and whatever I do not spend gobs of money wise on these bundles for the giveaways, I'm going to go ahead and try to get every signature card available for this set because they look amazing. All right, that's it. I rambled enough. I will see you all in the next video.